Peace and blessings. How you all doing? This is Zebra Fall with the Black Urban Gardening Society. Please like and subscribe to our channel. Please share our videos with your family, friends, and loved ones. All right, today we're going to do a video on broccoli. So you could see what broccoli looks like uh, prior to going to seed. All right. And so in the process of a plant going to seed, it basically is when a plant is ready to reproduce, make seeds for the next generation. That is a really cool thing. Uh, but what can become problematic with that <clears throat> is when it begins that process, the plant basically absorbs all of its nutrients to make flowers. And in the process of making flowers, uh, the taste does get compromised with the plants. And so it doesn't taste that good, okay? But we're going to show you some of our broccoli heads. Um, broccoli is a brassica. It is a cool weather crop. I got this, um, these plants in the ground a little later than I normally would. We should have probably got them in in early to mid-February. I got them in to early early uh, second week of March, mid-March. Okay, so a lot of that cool weather that we want with our broccoli, we're sort of missing out on. But some of them, we will still get, you know, somewhat of a harvest. Now, the heads that you see and that we're used to eating on the broccoli is actually just a flowering top. And if you could see with this broccoli here, I don't know if you guys could see it, but there's yellowing. So that's letting us know that this broccoli is actually, the head is getting ready to go to seed. It is still at an edible stage, so we will harvest, harvest the broccoli heads and um, we'll just refrigerate them or freeze them and um, save them for a later date. But with, brass, with broccoli being a brassica, uh, many of the pests that broccoli has are the same pests that uh, attack your other brassicas. Uh, so that's something you want to look out for. But for me, the biggest issue with broccoli is not really the pest. It is the crop just getting in in time. Uh, the locale that I live in, um, a lot of times our springs are not long enough. In our winters, we sort of go from spring to winter instantly. All right. So what we're seeing here is our broccoli our broccoli florets, which once again is simply a flowering top of the broccoli. Um, you just want to harvest it before it flowers. And for some of our heads of broccoli, we're right at that stage of flowering. All right, so we could see like with this one is flowering. You can see with the smaller heads here, um, even those are going to get ready to flower. Um, and so it's, it's basically almost impossible to slow this process down with a plant like broccoli because the flowering head, the floret, is the edible part of the plant. So plant your broccoli early, protect your broccoli. Um, there are different varieties of broccoli. You have this heading broccoli, you have sprouting broccoli, which I like to grow as well. All right, but definitely choose your broccoli. Try to get it in early, try to protect your crop, extend your seasons. We've been fortunate to have little cooler spring than we've been having um, so I think it's allowed us to get a little bit more growth but this is a part of our broccoli crops here all right and we just want to show you what broccoli looks like when it's growing uh, so you can see here there is uh, no head development at all to a smaller head developing I'm sorry for moving the camera so much but with this broccoli right here and the others you can see that there's a larger head developing the floret. <clears throat> Excuse me. And so we definitely will harvest uh, our broccoli. Uh, there are two main edible parts. Uh, you definitely have the floret and then you have the stalk here. Um, now we have uh, and regularly harvest the leaves as well. Uh, I like to chop the leaves up and lacto ferment them. And um, so that is edible as well. But please um, like and subscribe to our channel if you dig it. Please share this video with your family and friends. And remember the food you grow is the food you know. Peace.